day says a lot about Limeade's culture. So the idea that we carve out time throughout this week and we brainstorm and then the big day where we present it back, that's a lot of time to carve out and it's, it says a lot about everybody rolling up their sleeves and wanting to be part of it. So it is noon. We have a really packed schedule today. As you guys might have seen, we have 20 Own It Day presentations. So Own It Day is an opportunity for anyone inside of the company to own innovating in the product. They can have an idea, they can see a problem, they get to pitch it. I think something like Own It Day is just this cool opportunity for people to feel like, hey, I actually can really be a vital part of this organization, and that it doesn't matter where I sit, I can still have a huge impact. I'll give you a one minute warning and a 30 second warning. Let's hit it. So, really simple idea, communication banner at the top. It's a relatively small addition, but something that I think will have make a pretty big impact. We want to streamline the QA process. We want to cut config time by up to half. Leading into the pitch on Monday. Um, first thing is I'm a little nervous, right? I'm about to get up in front of the entire company for the second time since I've been hired. But also the energy in the room was unbeatable. Everyone was rooting for you. So they gave me a little more confidence getting up in front of everybody. Monday's pitch was really fun. I, I like it. I like uh, doing silly presentations. Um, it was great to stand in front of everyone and have an idea and have people resonate with that and have people get excited about that. I didn't view anybody up there as a competition because it felt like we were all trying to just make the product better. So when you're trying to find a participant, <laughs> kind of like you're looking for somebody. <laughs> wearing my hoodie all zipped up and I had the glasses and hat in my pocket and I was nervous like is everyone just gonna think I'm weird putting on this hat and glasses randomly um, but then I was like you just gotta go for it and it was it was really fun so from here there's a lot of uh, activity thing that's going on even right this minute so they have to go recruit the different resources and get those people together and work together to form this form this solution My name is Carol Stanley, and the name of my project is Where's Waldo? The idea is to have a way to identify a test user, whereas right now, when you are log in as a test, our test accounts, they are essentially a real live participant in the site. When we go here to settings, right here, uh -huh. it says participant, we'd want to be able to add Test yes. So recruiting was very fast paced. Uh, you know, you give your presentation on Monday and you're just like, go. And so uh, I made a few recruiting flyers and I said, will you help me find Waldo? And I needed a dev, I needed a, a PM, I needed a QA, but it was actually a really great tool for me to meet other people in the company and ask them to bring their skills to the table. And I, I feel really good about our team. My name is Ryan Putnam, and our code name for our pitch was Sunday Funday. The configs, which is my job, we actually have to go in and change code on the site. And when we do that, there's no way to do it for tomorrow. We have to do it for right now. And so we're trying to build in a feature so that we can have it show up tomorrow as opposed to right now. Uh, so in this morning's meeting, we had Caitlin and myself and Miles, and it was great. We started with uh, identifying the process how do you get the image into the promo bars? And then once we were able to identify the process, we can identify the problems within the process. There's no way to preview the promo bar before putting it live in the site. As soon as you hit update, you're, you're live. From there, we were able to prioritize and say, okay, what is the first thing that we want to get done to make this process and these problems go away? My name's Leah Marley, and the name of our project is Email Like a Boss. We have this really broken user experience when we're trying to accurately um, quality assure and test emails that we're sending from the platform. Vicki is so much fun to collaborate with, number one, because she has this real user experience eye. We were just talking about the painfulness of the seven emails I think I had her send out in one day. And we just said, wouldn't it be so cool if we could just send this to one person? It was like, own a day, done. It was over, it was over from then, yeah. We knew we were going to do this. Of course, 
anything is possible. So we always have these really big ideas, but we had to scope this specific idea and bring it down to an appropriate level for being built in a day, which is a really short time frame. I think the biggest roadblock is everyone's dreaming really big and we only have a day. So it's what can we change right now? And is it going to be a foundation for the future? We've got some ideas that are they're a little bigger than a bread box, frankly, um, but they're good ideas. And just because they can't engineer their idea on Friday doesn't mean we can't help them flesh their idea out more and then think about how we get those into the product stream as soon as possible. I haven't really thought super into the future about Monday. It's just about what can we accomplish today, um, but I'm definitely hoping to work the theme into the final presentation on Monday. So we might see Waldo in the presentation on Monday, maybe. So first of all, thank you. Thanks a lot to everyone who pitched, who owned, showed so much passion during the last week. All right, hi everyone. Uh, we're going to talk about some promo bar scheduling. And, I feel like uh, the promo bar demo went really well. So as you can see, you have the active uh, default promo bar um, available there. And it'll be really great to start using the promo bar probably later on this year. Um, there's still some scoping that needs to happen, but it's nice to have a solid design to start from. The presentation went really well today. So let's walk through the demo. This is a real thing, guys. It's like, ready? And then underneath that radio button is basically a text field where you can input all of the email addresses you want to send to. Whoa. Okay. <laughs> Our feature works. There's a few QA issues, but those will be kinks worked out as it heads into staging. Nice. Thanks, you guys. Great job. The presentation went great today. Uh, we were able to show a demo of logging into the site as a test user which was the ultimate goal of our project, of what we accomplished on Friday. Did we find Waldo? I don't know, maybe he's around here somewhere. <laughs> <laughs> it's so neat to see people who aren't maybe the loudest voices or the ones that are, you always see here be the ones that we're presenting. It was neat to see that. I, just started working Lime Made about three months ago here, so it's kind of scary to stand up in front of the whole company and say, hey guys, this is my idea. And you stand up there and everyone's like, hey, go for it, you got, it. You got this. And it was just, it was very empowering. And then I thought it was really great that a company is willing to take a day and just say, hey, we have some really smart people in here and everyone has really great ideas. Let's take this day and just go for it. And I just, I thought it really fit in with my mission and just that value of own it. Just get out there and just do something. <laughs> <laughs>